through the darkness the zombie did call. True pain and suffering he brought to them all. Away ran the children to hide in their beds, for fear that the devil would chop off their heads. <laughs> Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Chris coming at you from the channel I Am Toys. Been a while since I, uh, I did a review, right? You know, trying to get back in the swing of things, getting some content out. You know, we're all busy in our lives. So definitely privileged to be able to pop this figure out, man, because uh, this is a, uh, a figure by Macabre Art Studios. Uh, it's run by Dan Terzo and his partner. And uh, this is by far gonna be one of their best releases. And you guys can check them out on Instagram. You can check them out on Facebook. Hit up Dan over at Galactables on Instagram and he has his YouTube channel by the same handle. And uh, you can also hit me up on Instagram as well, you know, on IG, same handle. Um, you know, I am toys and I can point you in the right direction if you need to. And I'll try to have some of the links to everybody, you know, down, um, you know, in the description of this video as well. But this is none other than the uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre movie, Leatherface, uh, that Netflix put out a while ago. You know, some people were, you know, not exactly, uh, they were on the fence, you know, some people dug it, some people had their gripes, but honestly, man, it, it was gory, it was bloody, it had a reasonably good story, you know, had good kills, you know, it played on some of the cultural aspects of stuff going on in our, in our, uh, in our life right now, and, you know, stuff going on in the world. Uh, with just uh, young folks, you know, millennial type stuff, and like, <laughs> it's just, it's great, man. Um, so I, I thought it was cool. I thought it was cool that they integrated some of this stuff. Um, but as always, man, like and subscribe, share the content, because if you don't, guess what? Nobody really gets to see this stuff. And if you are interested in this, uh, in this set, there might actually be some spots left, but by the time I actually put this video up, they may all be gone. So if, if, if that happened, um, you know, I'm sorry. But uh, definitely hit them up because Macabre, you know, they, they will work with you. Um, you know, Dan and, 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 and everybody, you know, they'll work with you. If, you know, there's payment plans. You can do half down, half later. You know, you can, um, uh, you know, even work uh, within that still. And, you know, if you have some circumstances, you need to do something else. You know, as far as the payment plan, they might even be able to work with you there. And, uh, you know, so it's cool. You know, I, I, you know, myself, Rob Terzo and Dan and, you know, Macabre in general, you know, we're trying to create a, a nice kind of feedback system where, you know, you're, you're going to see a lot of different prototypes, um, you know, and then I'm going to be on some of those runs, Rob's going to be on some of those runs, and some of them we won't, but we're going to do reviews of the figures because, you know, when we're trying to create a system um, that, you know, probably hasn't really existed, in, you know, in the custom hobby really where, you know, we're, they're going to feed, you know, Macabre is going to give us these prototypes, you know, before the runs um, are actually released or while they're in production, and you're going to get to see them. You know what I mean? And then I'm gonna, we're gonna send them back, you know, the Macabre, and then we'll have another one and um, do that and, and do that one as well. And some of the stuff that Dan has in the works that I've, I've already seen, man, dude, like uh, some of the next couple of videos are gonna be sick. And, you know, that's, this is how it should be. You know, you should be able to see these pieces, you know, before the uh, runs come out per se, or at least close. And, um, you know, you're gonna see a lot more uh, stuff from us. And, th and this stuff is fun, man, you, you know, for me and for all of us. So. It's, it's cool to be able to show you guys, you know, the, the art, these art pieces uh, before they come out and then, you know, shift them back to the creator, you know, get another one and um, show you more, man. Uh, you know, like I said, this is fun for me. So let's, uh, let's get into it. And like I said, man, like and subscribe, you lazy, you lazy watchers who never like the video and don't ever subscribe. <laughs> All right, see you on the, uh, on the other side. As always, we'll start from the bottom up, right? So this is the bottom of the dio. This dio is actually made out of real wood. Uh, you're gonna get that hammer, you're gonna get the bloody foot, the severed foot, you're gonna get real laces and the boots. You know, this is all custom tailored. This is the second head. As you can see, I'll show you that as well and I'll flip it so you can see the second head on there. Um, it's just, man, just nice and bloody, blood-soaked, uh, you know, reminiscent of the film. And again, everything is custom tailored. And this, man, this is a nice little, little Easter egg cherry on top. The actual company name right on there. Bad ass, man. Nice. I love it. You can, even through the blood work and the weathering, it, it comes through really nicely. And obviously you get the blood work on the, uh, well, you get the blood work on the, uh, the actual um, blade itself. Sorry that's going out of focus, man. I got it on a wide focused uh, spread right now, so I gotta back up a little bit. Um, but as you can see, man, details are all there. An awesome blood work on the hands, the, uh, the outfit itself. Again, this is all custom tailored. 
And then, man, that money head, dude. Look at that. Look at those eyes, man. Just staring at you, dude. Cold, hard murderer. <laughs> and uh, back up a little bit here so you can kind of see it from the side. Show you some side profiles of it. And on the, the back dio, as you can see here, you get the little painting on there. This is gonna have stronger magnets too as well. Again, everything's probably gonna be improved because uh, it is a little weak in the corner. You know, if you go down here, um, right there, it is a little weaker. Uh, so you gotta be a little careful, but they are gonna improve that. That's something that they're gonna fix. And um, man, just overall, man, this is a friggin' sick, sick figure, man. Absolutely awesome uh, weathering and blood work on this fucking thing, man. And uh, looks great when compared to the movie. So those of you who have seen the film, I love this. And some of you are gonna wanna just display either this head or a combination of both. Your OCD may make you wanna buy two figures. I know that shit happens to me quite a bit. <laughs> and uh, maybe some aerial shots as well. Just badass, man. But I think, I think when mine shows up, I'm probably gonna go with the bloody head for a while because it just looks fucking sick. But I don't know, we'll see what happens, man. I got bad OCD when it comes to figures, dude. Some figures you gotta have two. Like that McCready, man. <laughs> but I ended up selling it. I ended up selling my other McCready, which kind of pisses me off because now my, all my OCD is like, I don't know how to pose it. <laughs> I can't make up my mind. But this is, uh, man, just from the outside, like I said, just panning out and in, man, just, you get to soak all that in from all the fucking angles, dude. Just bad fucking ass, man. And like I said, hit up Dan, hit up Macabre, see if they got some runs left because, and again, I apologize if you hit them up and there's none left, but, you know, that's the, that's the name of the game, though, you know what I mean? Just fucking wow, man, you know what I mean? Look at this shit. So, I'm gonna swap the heads. So you guys can see that as well. Man, I, again, I just love it that the fucking name of the company is, is there. You know what I mean? And you can see it. And through all the weathering and the blood. Again, nice touch to details, man. And this is the kind of work they're going to try to put out for you guys. And man, I'm telling you, I can't wait to, to see more. So let's flip that other head and go from there. I know what's coming next. Ow! <laughs> you guys know I love doing my sculpt reviews, my reveals, <laughs> like that. <laughs> but goddamn, dude, it's just like, I'm gonna fucking kill you all. <laughs> man, it's just absolutely sick, man. Absolutely sick. Look at that shit, dude. Like, for me, that's how I'm displaying mine, man. And I, I can't wait to see what they improve. Uh, from this to the prototype, I mean, to the actual production, man, just fucking nasty, dude. Nasty. And again, this is all full custom by Macabre Studios and Dan Terzo, run by Dan Terzo and his partner. Oh, damn, dude, just fucking, like, <laughs> and then here's the, uh, the regular head by itself, just chilling. That's my stand. I don't think you're gonna be getting one of those. You're gonna buy your own. <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, just again, if you like it, hit them up, hit me up. I'll point you in the right direction if they have any left. Again, I apologize if they're all fully sold out. So please don't come back to me very angry. <laughs> but wowzers, man, this is where it's at. Man, every time I do a damn review or I have my figure out or I do a repose or something, I gotta watch the damn movie again. So that's probably what I'm gonna do is watch this shit again tonight. <laughs> oh man, it's just badass, dude. Fucking love it. So in the comments, man, you know, let me know what you think about the figure. Talk about the movie a little bit. I think one of my favorite kills was the uh, in the very beginning um, with the uh, the first girl in the in the car or the jeep or van or whatever it was oh no the ambulance right that was uh that was a brutal kill i mean obviously there's more than that but i don't know i think they they started off the movie well with that man and again like the blood work on everything the clothes you know the tie the apron everything is just really nice and gritty man just fucking 
just, I mean, this is the type of figure that sits on your shelf and it's a showstopper. <laughs> For real, man. I mean, that head, dude, like, just wow, man. Whew. Damn, dude. That is nasty. So again, you know, stay tuned to this channel for more reviews and, uh, you know, more content coming from Macab and just reviews from me in general. And uh, I think you guys are going to be in for some awesome surprises. And again, I can't say enough about this piece, man, and, and to Macab for throwing it my way to let me review it. And then look out for maybe Rob to review this piece and some other pieces as well over at Anomaly. And man, just stay collecting, dude, and collect what you love. Don't let anybody dictate what you should be collecting. You know what I mean? Collect what's close to your heart, dude. This is why I collect what I collect now. Still like some of the superhero stuff too and some other genres, but horror is my bag, baby. All right, guys. Remember, like, subscribe, hit me up, hit Dan up, and uh, watch this damn movie if you haven't seen it. <laughs> I think I've given you all the details that I can. I'm trying to remember to just like anything at all that I could possibly be forgetting, but I think that was pretty much it, man. You know, again, everything is custom made and um, hand tailored essentially, so. And again, I think I mentioned you're going to get the laces, the accessories. Yeah, I think that's it, man. I don't think I'm forgetting anything. Dan, if I forgot something, I'm sorry. <laughs> but again, dude, it's just, I mean, this is it. This is everything that you get, guys. Everything. It just fucking blows me away, dude. And it's for a reasonable price, too, man. It's not fucking going to break your bank, you know what I mean? And you're getting a nice product. Quality product. All right, my peeps, deuces.